what Netflix does with recommending TV shows and movies to you by comparing your preferences to others. That's what we try to do with sizes. We learn about you, we compare you to other customers, and the same thing we do with, uh, with um, items as well. And based on that, um, come up with a recommendation that will work the best for you. Mm -hmm. No, that sounds very smart. Uh, uh, specifically, what you mentioned, international sizes. I was in Bangkok last week trying to buy some T-shirts, ended up buying T-shirts in 4XL, which in the <laughs> United States would be a complete different game. Um, and these T-shirts are still quite slim, to be honest. So um, when it comes to international stores, I mean, how do you find out they're sourcing from all over the world as a, as a fashion store? Um, you have all your SKUs and they might have different sizes. So you might be a retailer sourcing from different sources with different sizes. How do you break it down to a product that you know this product is basically this size in real yeah. life? It's a very good question. And actually, in fact, we know for sure that uh, even uh, big and more established brands, they will not have consistent sizing even within the same category. So if you have like, let's say a pair of pants and maybe it's like, let's say winter collection or a classic collection or so on, like they might actually fit you differently as a person. Um, that's why we also figured out early on that um, we cannot just have one sizing sort of recommendation logic for everything that uh, an online store sells. So those recommendations must be on an SQ basis. So um, what we came up with is a concept of size models. So essentially size models is a setting um, that you can um, set up within our app. And um, that setting represents how a certain item is supposed to fit people. And it means that you can group products into one size model. So if you know that, let's say these five sweatshirts, they fit the same way, but this one is very unique, you can assign different size models to them. Um, those indicating to our algorithm that they should be treated differently. Um, and size models also allow you as a brand, as an owner of a store, um, indicate whether products are running bigger or smaller or whether they should be very sensitive towards like um, different answers that a customer is giving and so on. 